Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so what comes up comes out. Let's see what this week holds for you Capricorn, the emperor. This could be you. This could be someone you're dealing with. Um, we've got the emperor showing up. So you could be um, self-mastery is what I'm hearing. Maybe even becoming an expert in your field. You, this could be the, your counterpart. Also, your boyfriend, your husband, um, a masculine energy that brings a lot of stability and direction here. Um, this could also be in career. It just seems as you, you might be the emperor. You made something out of nothing here. Uh, let's see the high priestess okay so this could be so this is man and woman energy definitely this could be a relationship but one that is kind of in the shadows it's, it's something hidden here something that's not to the forefront or it is not without label or form here Something is in still in gestation period, like someone hasn't made something official or something isn't official. Somebody is doing nothing. Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles. This could also be bringing up gestation. This could be that someone is pregnant. This would be the early term pregnancy, maybe not even knowing. This is also maybe having a secret plan to maybe start something new. The Ace of Pentacles came out for Virgo. You could be dealing with the Virgo. There could be infer infertility issues. In I can heard implantation. Maybe this could even be going and getting some uh, fertility uh, treatments, shots. Something about something being, you know, unstable or unstable. Um, instability, infertility. Somebody's upset, saddened by the fact that something can't grow or it's not growing, or that there's something there's a hidden element about a relationship. There could be a third party here that hasn't come to the the forefront. This third party could be pregnant or something about pregnancy. This is an interesting dynamic here for you, Capricorn. Let's uh, clarify Capricorn's reading. The Hermit card, wow, you definitely could be dealing with a Virgo here. All of a sudden, so, something is, um, Somebody wants to apologize. Someone wants to come back and reignite. Somebody is desiring you or you're desiring to be with someone. It's like you're leaving one place to go to another, maybe even finishing up something and then moving on. It's like you got secret plans to start something, something to start something, a relationship, a situation, just a new life elsewhere. You understand that you, this is self-actualization to you. You actually see that maybe you need to do something else. You need to go somewhere else. You need to let go. Something also could get found out here. That maybe somebody's discontent, bored with their partner, staying for the children. There could be something taboo in terms of sex and sexuality that somebody is into. Once again, it could come to light. Somebody could start to live in their truth. Somebody's all offering, um, okay, I heard recompense or at least an apology. Somebody's been doing this for a very long time or waiting for the timing. This is what I have for you, Capricorn. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. You can also go over to the website, book your own reading there. You can ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can um, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you, Capricorn. Many blessings to you.